Hello friend, in this session we are going to learn how to integrate sonar scanner for Gradle project. So let's start. So here we will start with what is sonar scanner for Gradle. So sonar scanner for Gradle is a plugin that allows you to easily integrate sonar cube, a popular core quality and security analysis tool into your Gradle based project. This plugin enables you to run static code analysis on your code base and generate detailed report to identify bugs, security vulnerabilities, code smell, and other qualities. Okay, this is Sonar Scan for Gradle. So let's see here prerequisite for that. So we have prerequisite ensure you have installed Java installed on your machine. So let's see on my machine Java is installed or not. Let's check using open your command prompt and type here Java hyphen space hyphen version. You see here on my system I have already installed Java version 17.0.3. Okay. So let's see second ensure you uh, you have sonar install or not and it's running so see here here I have already installed this sonar cube dashboard okay so it's means install and it's running the sonar cube and after that see here make sure gradle is installed and configured on your machine so let's see open your command prompt and check gradle is installed or not properly so let's see using Gradle hyphen budget. See ya. Here I have already installed Gradle. It's version Gradle 8.4. Okay. So after that we have to see how to use Sonar Scanner for Gradle project. So here some steps we have to use sonar scanner for gradle project so first step is install sonar cube plugin in gradle so let's see here open your project and build.gradle file and add the sonar cube plugin in that build.gradle so let's see firstly i have i will open this project on your desktop here gradle project open it and this is my Gradle project. So we have to open Gradle.bell. So open this and search where your Gradle.bell. So in that app here, this bell. So I will open with Visual Studio. Okay. okay. Here I have already opened it. Build dot Gradle. So after that we have to add your plugin ID so org dot sonar cube and its version. Okay. So let's just copy and paste in your build dot Gradle. So here I have already added here org dot sonar cube and its version. Okay. So in that way we can add it. After that let's see <coughs> configure your sonar cube property in your build gradle build file so again you have to configure the properties so in that way we can configure it like sonar dot host dot url means here we have to add this value regarding this key okay so here ftp localhost polar 904 so this this URL you have to add in your this sonar dot post dot URL. After that, this is your sonar cube server URL. After that, you have to add the sonar project key. Here, give your name sonar project key, and after that, property enter the sonar dot project name here. Yeah. Which project name you have to enter as your requirement? You can mention. 
and after add the other required properties like here I have already added here sona dot login sona dot password sona dot source source means there are two source and green where we are file program is saved and where we are test this is first test so like that properties you can add it here okay so let's see i have already added all this property here in that property section here in the properties and here at the property name and its value okay after that let's see here i mentioned the all this meaning of that property here and after that you have to run the sona scanner command so let's open your terminal to run this command gradle w sona scanner let me copy this command and execute in your terminal okay so where your project is saved here uh, our project is saved and open here your terminal you see here my terminal and in the here this gradle w sonar run this command it will execute your project to your terminal okay so let's see now starting the gradle one Let's wait for that project to run. So see here uh, our project will success. Okay, our federal project will success. Let's see next step. We have to see your sonar cube analysis result on your sonar cube dashboard. Let's see go to your sonar cube dashboard and go to your project. You see here. It's loading. Our gradle project example of smart scanner for gradle here you can see here you can analyze it with your project okay the only note is okay. 
here you can analyze your uh, sonar scanner for gradle project here reliability of zero security vulnerabilities maintainability security review all you can analyze from your sonar okay so in this way we will learn how to integrate sonar scanner for gradle project for analyzing a java project in sonar so thank you for the watching video